Hey guys, how's it going? Toby here. Welcome back to a brand new video here on my channel. Welcome to my top 5 best silver left wingers. And I really enjoy looking back at some silver players because I often forget about them completely. Like when I've done these previous top 5s because I've done a top 5 best left wingers. And sometimes, you know, you completely forget about some silver players. And I kind of mainly did the best gold players when I was doing my top 5s before. And... I want to go back and revisit some of the silver players that are actually completely amazing. Now, if you do need to get some coins, check the link in the description for the FIFA shop.co.uk and use the code TOBY10 for a discount. They've got three awesome ways to get coins. Or, if you'd prefer some MSP and PSN codes, go to g2a.com and use the code TBY3 to get some money off there as well. So, the runners-up are going to be Elanusi's brother who has 5 star skills actually, it's really really good we've got Sammy from Porto and we have Sacco from Wolves and they're all really good but they just don't have that extra edge that the players in the countdown do have now Arayo is going to be our first one 4 star weak foot, 5 star skills, incredible pace and 74 shooting and 74 physical on a silver card is really really impressive and his dribbling feels generally really smooth I enjoy using him and occasionally and this is occasionally, he does get pushed off the ball, but I think it's just a case of Silvers often have relatively low balance and lower stats than most gold, so it's not really much of a problem. Number four is going to be Tarek Elianusi. Decent pace, really awesome shooting, and Bundesliga silver teams, you have so many, so many players that you can choose from, which is really cool. He does often get pushed off the ball. This guy, he is fairly weak, but... It's not too much a problem if you can get ahead of them, and if you can, you can get ahead, cut inside. He also has a four-star weak foot, which is always really, really nice. I think he is right-footed, though, on that left-hand side, which is pretty awesome. Number three is going to be Mane from Southampton. 90 pace, 70 shooting, four-star skills. Again, a little bit weak, but those silver BUPL teams can be ridiculously deadly if you've ever used one with like a bong lahore up front my word it is so so much fun to go into that silver tournament and just completely wreck other teams like really really strong players we've got a really strong sense of like direction change in my like he he's very good at just changing direction in a similar way to neymar not as good as neymar but the way he does it, because he's so fast, is quite similar. Number two is going to be S. Vine, and a player that everyone loves to hate. He's six foot tall, which is brilliant. Fairly strong. Very, very good finishing. And his dribbling feels a lot better than 74. I always felt that that was a bit unfair. His card stat is, is quite low for dribbling, but in-game actually feels pretty good. And those strong links, so many good German silvers that you can throw into a team. So... A very, very good left-sided player. And number one is going to be Mark Gonzalez. This card probably shouldn't be silver given the stats it's got. 84 pace, 78 shooting. Like, that is crazy for a silver card. Ridiculous long shots. Some really good links in the Chile League as well. So that's quite cool. And he does have four-star skills. His strength is a bit hit and miss. Occasionally, he's pretty strong. Occasionally, he's pretty weak, so I wouldn't really comment too much on that, but overall, he is definitely my favorite silver left wing. He is so, so good. So, that's my top five. Gonzalez, S. Van Mane, Elianusi, and Arroyo, and it's just a solid, solid five countdown, and most of them, bar Elianusi, have over 70 shooting, which is really important for me on silvers. I don't know why. It's, just, it's, it's nice to have. So let me know in the comment section what are your top five silver left wingers. That would be superb to hear what you guys think. And if you have enjoyed the video, give it a big thumbs up. I'm always very, very grateful for your support. But take care, guys. Have an amazing day and goodbye.